This is JASP, the free and user-friendly way to do statistics. With JASP, you can analyze your data and present your results in a simple and intuitive way using both frequentist and Bayesian analyses. You can access your data set either locally on your computer or on the Open Science Framework. In the top bar, you can see the primary analysis groups, which contain the most popular statistical analyses in the social sciences. In addition to your standard collection of classic frequentist analyses, JASP also offers their Bayesian counterparts. This way, JASP promotes a more inclusive and informative approach to statistical inference. You can also conduct more advanced analyses in JASP. For instance, the SEM module allows you to perform structural equation modeling. And with our summary stats module, you can reanalyze and examine published findings without needing the original data. While you're conducting your analyses, the changes you make are immediately reflected in the output panel. This way, you see the updated results as you go. This is just one example of how JASP was designed to be user-friendly and interactive. JASP was also designed to support many aspects of scientific work, including the writing of an article or a report. To that end, with a few simple mouse clicks, you can copy the tables in JASP and paste them into your word processor. This way, you have an APA-style table with no fuss. This copy-paste functionality is also available for all of the plots in JASP. Moreover, you can save the plots in standard file formats, such as PNG or EPS, to accompany your article submission. We aim to facilitate scientific openness and transparency. This is why JASP makes it easy for you to reproduce and review the analyses of your students, collaborators, and colleagues. You can also annotate analyses within JASP, which allows you to create a record of the rationale behind your analyses and give the proper interpretation of your results. This benefits open science, peer review, and collaboration with colleagues. It can also benefit teaching by encouraging concrete interaction with students. You can also edit your data file within JASP with the data sync feature. You can access the raw data by double clicking on one of the cells in JASP. For example, you or your colleagues could add newly collected observations or add a new composite measure. Changes made to the data file are immediately reflected in your JASP analyses. See the link in the description below for a separate data editing tutorial. You can also easily publish your JASP results directly to the Open Science Framework. And this lets other people see your results without needing their own OSF account and without needing to install JASP on their machine. See the link in the description below for a separate JASP OSF tutorial video. Our team is constantly working to equip JASP with new features and new state-of-the-art statistical analyses. When you visit our website, jasp-stats.org, you can interact with the JASP team in various ways. First, you can post feature requests and suggestions for improvement on the JASP GitHub page. Second, you can ask statistical questions on the JASP forum. Third, you can follow JASP on Twitter or on Facebook. And finally, you can attend our annual summer workshop in Amsterdam, the home of JASP. These were just some of the features that JASP has to offer. For in-depth tutorials, subscribe to the JASP YouTube channel, or follow the link in the description to go to our website. Thanks for watching.